An iconic pier in Aptos is now split in two. The middle section just washed away. The pier leading to the cement ship severely damaged by the high surf impacting much of the central coast. It's a landmark that has stood the test of time until now. Large waves also swept through the Capitola village. KION's Carl Cook is live for us tonight in Aptos with how people there in the county are reacting to all the damage they're seeing, especially that one pier. Carl? Yeah, so right now you can see there is wind still coming in this area, but people are coming to see that ship. Now seeing what's been called the culture of Aptos being destroyed is breaking people's hearts tonight. These landmarks are important to the community and to people who visit here pretty often. The second day of this huge storm has been destructive. In Capitola, the pier was sliced in half by dangerous waves. In Aptos, the famous cement ship broke apart. The pier connecting to the ship also felt the wrath of the wind and ocean. Now, the strong winds have died down just a little bit, but they're still impacting how people are viewing the ship. If you look right behind me here, people are taking cameras, doing little video shots of that ship and how those waves are crashing into it. Now, one person I spoke to who did not want to be on camera said this ship is more than just a ship. It's an important landmark to this community for current generations and the next ones. Uh, super sad. It's been like a, it's just always been here. I've lived here my entire life and it's always just been here. It's like a part of Aptos. I remember when it cracked a few years ago and that was a giant deal and just to see it so destroyed is like, I mean, she's lived here her whole life, but so have I. You know? so it's, it's just as insane to be like, oh my gosh, this historical thing is yeah. destroyed now, you know. Other people haven't lived here as long as the McCords, but they left the pier shocked by what they'd seen. Nico Jones learned about the history of the ship and the pier from his dad. Sometimes, yeah, he like would mention like why it's there and all that. And it's, it's cool and it's crazy, but it's even crazier to see it like this now. Now, earlier, I was informed by a California State Parks officer that this beach and beaches in the surrounding area will be closed until further notice due to the impacts of the storm. Reporting from Aptos, I'm Carl Cook, KION News Channel 46. It is unfortunate to see. Thank you, Carl. The city of Santa Cruz also telling KIO and crews are also assessing all the damage over on West Cliff Drive and will update us as soon as they get more information.